hey guys and welcome back to my channel if you are new welcome my name is Naomi Knott and today as you guys can see by the title this is a long overdue video so you guys have been asking me and listen you guys have been don't say <laughs> who's been asking all of y'all been asking about my natural hair so i did a little thing on instagram like this you know the questions thing yeah i said any questions that you want to ask about my natural hair just put them down and you guys um sent a couple of questions so i'm going to be answering those questions and i did film a wash day routine like a while back like a long time ago so i'm gonna incorporate the wash day routine with um this q a please like comment and subscribe you guys listen this is a road to 4k i almost said 5k wow guys wow setting the bar high for myself yes but if this is a road to 4k please like comment and subscribe to my channel and let's get into the video so um i screenshotted the questions right here um on my phone i did ask these questions like a long time ago like a while back so if you have not followed me on my instagram please follow me somewhere here also the like my instagram is down in the description um the first question is which products do you use on your hair so i'm gonna insert a clip i hope i hope i hope everything is gonna be synchronized because I don't remember what I filmed, but um, a quick summary of what I use to shampoo my hair, shampoo and conditioner. What? Shampoo and condition my hair. I use the Tresemme. Um, I think it's for dry and damaged hair. Um, you guys will see the clip. And then, and then I deep condition my hair with the Dove something I don't know. It's like a deep conditioning thing from Dove. After deep conditioning then i go into oiling my hair and oiling my hair i use the cantilever conditioner and argan oil and a secret surprise so i along this video you will see the secret ingredient that i use to moisturize my hair the second question is what's the best way to stretch your hair out without using i don't know what the last word says but I'm, I'm going to just say what's the best way to stretch your hair out so what I usually do is after washing my hair I usually put them in twists um, like really comb out your hair after washing don't like pull your hair just like little combing of the hair and then um, twist your hair stretch it out combing really stretches out the hair so that you can twist it and then it keeps the length and then you can do the old-fashioned mapondo guys just do mapondo with wulu tamuriri wrap it around and you'll probably look like a freaking ho -ho or something but like use wool to stretch out your hair it really does help you know it helped our mothers our grandmothers our great great grandmothers our great 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 grandmothers so i feel like you can use wool and then another way to stretch your hair is um putting it in cornrows or flat twists Flat twists, I don't know how to do flat twists, but I usually do cornrows on myself. Obviously, they're messy, but it's just like to stretch out the hair because, you know, you're braiding your hair. It's stretching out and keeping it um, as a protective style. And then the second question is, best protective style, right on time. Best protective style, I would say anything really, as long as you're pleating your hair, to be honest. You can cornrow your hair. Um you can do box braids you can do really anything any protective style really works but i usually have because i'm the person that i am i'm lazy um i usually just like leave my hair in cornrows and then wear twists or have it as a hair wrap and look ugly but it's okay and i usually do um either box braids i did these on myself you can do um faux locks you can do really anything anything that keeps your hair um protected also moisturize your hair before you actually do these styles and then the next question is do you recommend pe the pill to see products i don't really know i have not really been interested in the pearl to see products so you can try them out if you want to but i really don't even know um 
if they work i don't know the ingredients i don't know what's in there i don't know i really don't know um if those products will work then how long did you grow your hair four years oh let me count months four years five months i'm very proud i am very proud it was an accomplished this is like literally an accomplishment for me the first time i cut my hair being me it was an impossible decision i'm like i'm tired of having natural hair so i'm gonna cut my hair off tell me why i look like a man I look like a gentleman. That's what I look like. So I've really been growing my hair out. It's been a long, 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 long journey. I don't know if you want me to do a video on my natural hair journey or something. Just comment down below. But I can do that and tell you everything. Like everything. And then how often do you moisturize it? If I'm honest with you guys, I'm very guilty. I do not moisturize my hair that often because i'm lazy like i'm really for a person that loves having natural hair and for a person that's like you know a natural hair advocate i don't do the right things guys i i don't do it i i, I don't do it girl but i moisturize my hair when i wash my hair <laughs> okay it's not really funny it's bad don't do that don't do that but i i would recommend moisturizing your hair if you have your hair out a lot like if you just wear your hair out i would i would recommend you moisturizing probably like every week every two weeks depending on how the texture of your hair like how your hair reacts to like the weather and all that but guys please moisturize your hair don't be like me like right now i have not moisturized my hair since i did this hairstyle <laughs> baby girl that's bad which hair products do you use answer that girl how do you keep it from shrinking I don't <laughs> you can't my hair shrinks to the gods actually it doesn't shrink to the gods it shrinks down to the roots that's what it does like you guys have seen um how long my hair is like i think i'll insert a clip or something but my hair is long guys tell me why it ends up like this i go back to looking like a man again honestly i go back to looking like a man i'm like what is wrong what is wrong but nonetheless guys if I can tell you shrinkage is actually a good thing that means your hair is healthy that means your hair your hair something about your hair being healthy and if it can be long elongated and bounce back and all that but don't lose hope if you see a lot of shrinkage in your hair don't lose hope guys just like shrinkage is good as much as you know it really takes away the the fun out of having natural hair because you're always thinking that oh my hair's not growing my hair's not growing but your hair is growing believe me now that i've been stretching my hair out a lot in, in those clips and seeing how long my hair is perfect just leave the sh leave the shrinkage alone honey which method do you use loc or lco so in my wash day routine i mentioned that i use loc be like oba king asked this question oba king chabanga please subscribe to his channel conversations with oba he asked this question and thank you for asking that question because now i'm realizing that i don't use the loc i use the lco because um i obviously wet my hair and then i put the cantu leave-in conditioner which is a cream and then put the oils so um i use the loc and not the loc that's just in case the wash day routine shows up here and you hear L-O-C, but I use L-C-O. I feel like I'm confusing myself. I don't know what I just said, but I feel like I'm confusing myself. But yeah, I use the L-C-O because I feel like the oil at the end just seals in everything. If I have the cream put on top of the oils, I feel like it doesn't do anything, really. How often do you trim your hair? So, um again in the wash day routine i had not trimmed my hair in a couple of months and you guys are going to hear me say that um i have not trimmed my hair like in a long time but i suggest you trim your hair probably like every three months i'm not really sure about trimming hair but you have to trim your hair it's a must to trim your hair to get rid of like the dead ends it's literally like let me show you this wait this is why you should trim your hair you cut this off so the rest of the hair can grow this is a terrible example but you get me you really need to trim your hair just to allow for um new growth 
and for your hair to yeah just for your hair to grow and be healthy because if you have like dead it's like split ends it's like dead it's like dead hair at the end of um your hair and you know dead weight is bad dead weight just like doesn't let you progress in life so cut all of that off then the next question is how often do you wash your hair <laughs> what are your staple products and protective styles so i've answered what are my products and i've answered the protective styles and how often i wash my hair it's actually disappointing <laughs> i wash my hair when i feel like it i wash my hair when i feel like yo man you've been sitting there for too long like you need to get your hair washed but don't be like me kids please wash your hair probably every two weeks every month not every month i'm joking don't wash it every month but probably like every two weeks if you're having your hair out personally personally i wash my hair like every two months i know it's bad mm, don't do what i do but that's how often i wash my hair and just don't do that and the last question is do you blow dry your hair I have not blow dried my hair in two years or well, in 2019 probably two years almost two years probably I haven't blow dried my hair and I don't know I don't know how I feel about blow drying hair I want to blow dry my hair because I want I just want to see how long my hair is you know how blow drying like stretches out your hair but I want to actually try it out but I, if I'm going to blow dry my hair I'm going to do it at a professional like somebody who specializes in like natural hair and all that so I feel like I'm gonna do that but I don't know but I'm guys I don't know I feel weird about blow drying your hair because it really kind of breaks your hair okay that's what breaks your hair so yeah I don't know man I don't blow dry my hair but I want to blow dry it I have like mixed emotions about it but I'm gonna try it out and pro probably show you guys because you know we are family here and we do everything together so I'll probably show you guys and see how you know it turns out but yeah I don't blow dry my hair and I wouldn't advise that as well but even though I'm gonna do it but I would not advise it yeah So anyway, I hope you guys loved the video. Please do like, comment, and subscribe. And this is a row to 4K. Please tell your mama, tell your sister, tell your brother, tell your auntie, tell your brother, tell your uncle, tell your everybody. Just tell everybody in your neighborhood, in the city, in the country to subscribe to my channel, share the video, share my channel, and all that. And I'll see you in the next one. Mwah.